Hi there, Mrs. Nichols here. Let's talk about multiplying and dividing positive and negative fractions. When multiplying positive and negative fractions, there are three simple steps. One, determine the sign of the product. Two, cancel out any common factors. And three, multiply straight across. Let's take a look at this example. Five thirds times negative six sevenths. I'm looking at a positive times a negative. My product will be negative because my signs are different. Now that I've established that my product is negative, I can write a minus sign there for a negative product and just ignore the positive and negative signs from here on out. So I'm thinking 5 thirds times 6 sevenths. Let's look for common factors I can cancel out. Hmm. 6 and 3 have a common factor. 3 is equal to 3 times 1, and 6 is equal to 3 times 2. Therefore, I can cancel out these factors of 3, and my problem turns into 5 over 1 times 2 over 7. And when I multiply straight across, I get 5 times 2 is 10 over 1 times 7 is 7. Therefore, my product is negative 10 sevenths. Let's try another example. In this problem, we're looking at a negative times a negative. Anytime I have a negative times a negative, my product will be positive. Now that I've established that my product is positive, I can essentially ignore all the negative signs and just multiply these fractions. I'm taking 1 fourth times 7 ninths, and I can multiply straight across the numerator and straight across the denominator. 1 times 7 in the numerator gives me 7, and 4 times 9 in the denominator gives me 36. Therefore, my product is positive 7 36ths.